Yo, welcome, welcome, welcome to the second episode of Movie Madness. I'm your boy Enigma. And I'm your boy Kwame. And you know what we do? We're just going to jump in. We're just going to talk about what's been going on mm. in the movie world. Madness. The madness that's been going on yeah, in the movie world. So, okay, so what's, what are we going to start with? What's the first topic? And we're going to start off with the recent news that DC have a new film planned and that's going to be a link up between the iconic character of Bane and the iconic character of Deathstroke. Oh, yeah. They are teaming up or oh, yeah. being in a movie together and they're planning a new Bane and Deathstroke movie. Bruv, how do you feel I was about, about to ask you, Yeah, I was about to ask you that. Like, Bane and Deathstroke. Yeah, I mean, okay. I, <laughs> I don't know about this new run of making villain-led movies. Mm. I'm not a fan of it. I'm just not a fan of it. I don't like this sympathy for the devil perspective okay. that everyone yeah, is trying yeah, to yeah. have. Yeah, yeah. I feel like we're supposed to understand the hero. I don't think yeah. we're supposed to understand the villain. Yeah, yeah. Like, and I know, don't get me wrong, I get it in, in a lot of instances, to be a villain is just to have a different a difference of perspective. Mm. So you're not necessarily bad, you just have a difference of perspective. Yeah, which is, every villain thinks yeah. their plan is correct. Yeah, 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 yeah. so I, I get that, but I don't know, I feel like they try and shift our perspective on what was originally there in the first place mm. in terms of what we thought of these characters. Mm. So, I mean, I didn't I didn't understand the matchup between Bane and Deathstroke. Deathstroke yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yeah. get it, but Other I guess them we'll see. both being DC villains, yeah. and both being Batman enemies. Yeah. That's really it. To be yeah. Honest with you. Um, I think it's a it's a strange one. I'm going to be honest with you, and I think it's obvious that they're going to get them to team up, and then they're going to split them off into do their own individual mm. movies. That's mm. what I reckon will happen. So it'll almost be like a um, starts a Tango and Cash S link up, and then obviously mm. Tango and Cash have a spin off. But then they'll go and do their own movies, or they'll star in future Batman projects or future Superman yeah. projects and stuff like that. I think it's an interesting way to introduce them. However, one, I think Bane is going to be not difficult, but we've got the Tom Hardy version. Mm -hmm. Obviously, there's been many iterations of Joker and stuff, but I'm going to be very interested to see how they play Bane, what, what type of approach they're going to go with. Yeah, in. I am. And Deathstroke, while he's a character that we've seen him in Teen Titans, we, we know he mm -hmm. was supposed to be in Ben Affleck's Batman movie, he mm -hmm. was going to be the main villain. We saw him at the end of um, Justice League with that cut scene with Lex Luthor when he comes onto the boat when it was going to be played by Joe, Joe Magliano. Yeah. I don't think he's going to get the role this time. Yeah, um, I always find that weird when so, they do that. Yeah, it's a character we're familiar with, but mm. I think the general public don't really know Deathstroke. No, so again, really. it's just an interesting DC villain to start with. I feel like it's going to go the way of Suicide Squad. Yeah. And I'm saying that because Which it one? Is the David Ayer one or the James Gunn one? Definitely James Gunn okay. because it's James Gunn, isn't it? Okay. Yeah. You know? yeah, 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 yeah. And that's kind of what I think it is. I mean... I mean, okay, it's not going to go that way in terms of the comedy because mm -hmm. they can't do Bane and Deathstroke as comedy. If they, they do, they that's might, wild. But they might, uh, if they do, that's wild. It could be a buddy cop type of... They could, you know, I never thought about it like that. It could be that. I and never I'll, thought about it I'm like also that. worried they might try to make them both anti-heroes. This is... I was going to get to that. because so yes. Venom was a villain yeah. forever until the movies get made this and is, now he's an anti-hero. I don't like it. I don't like that, bro. Like, it bothers me mm. because it's like... I'm not saying you're either good or bad. Yeah. Yes, there's a little bit of a grey area, but these characters are known to be bad. bad. This is what yeah. they are. Yeah. They're bad. Yeah. This yeah. is the reason why they're villains in the first place. Yeah. Again, I don't like the route that Hollywood is going with sympathy for the devil. Yeah. That's what I yeah. call yeah. it. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. Trying to make us feel sorry for the bad guy. Yeah. No, yeah. I'm not yeah. feeling sorry for the bad guy. Yeah. They're yeah. bad guys for a reason. This is why we have heroes. We follow yeah. the heroes. And if they're the villains, who are they going to be fighting? That, thank you, because this is my thought process. Because mm. I'm thinking, okay, because whoever they're fighting against is going to be portrayed as the villain. Yes, yeah. Because yeah. obviously, with whoever lead in the movie we're supposed to like them it's just yeah. like the Joker film yeah, 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 like yeah. they try to paint Joker as he's the villain, he, he's yeah. The villain yeah. but you're trying to paint him as somebody that we're supposed to feel sorry for yeah yeah because that's what the whole up. film is make your mind up make yeah. Your mind up. Yeah, yeah, yeah 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 do you know yeah, what I mean yeah 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 I think again James Gunn and DC we said it in a previous episode how much is up in the air how much weighs so much firstly on the Superman but everything else that comes in between and I think 
like Bane and Deathstroke, this is gonna come after the new Superman, after the new Supergirl, after the new okay. Batman. We, we might not even make it this far. Big facts. If and I was gonna say, if have those we... those films bomb? Yeah. We might not make, we might not make it. And have far. we even seen anything to even know the direction they're going in? Because you realise they've kept everything under wraps. We haven't even seen a clip, yeah. nor hide, nor hair of yeah. nothing. Yeah. yeah, yeah. We need to know what direction they're going in yeah. because obviously he's not going in the direction of Zack Snyder. No. He's gonna be doing something completely different. Yeah. We've I'll, seen one picture, official picture of... Superman, Superman. Right? Superman. That's it. And yeah. I want to see visuals. I want to yeah. see like a whole, like a clip of yeah. something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a, yeah. just a finished, edited, rendered, you know, just colour, everything. Mm -hmm. I want to see just... Where you going with this? Yeah. Where are you going with this? And that's what I'm saying. Where are they going with this? Is it going to be really two villains? Really, is it going to be that? Or are you just going to try and make them both any heroes, set them up so they can have their own franchises? and hope that they can then have their own movie run, a la Venom. I'm, yeah, I'm not really the biggest fan.